If you live in Outagamie County, then you know how long the Highway 15 expansion bypass has been talked about. Well, local leaders finally got fed up with waiting for funding. And they are begging state lawmakers to let the project stay in Governor Tony Evers' budget. Alexander Burnley brings us more on the safety issues at stake if the project is passed over again. Inside the village of Hortonville Municipal Building, the village administrator read a proclamation about the need for the Highway 15 project to finally be funded after two decades of the state putting it off. Local leaders signed the proclamation to show their support. What we're failing to remember is that people are, are dying on our highways, um, and this is going to be for the betterment, betterment of our region. The money for the project was in former Governor Scott Walker's budget. Now it's in Governor Tony Evers' budget. These local leaders are asking state lawmakers to leave that money there and not take it away like they've done before. The governor's put it in the budget. Uh, clearly, the governor uh, supports it. The only thing we're asking. Uh, is for legislators just to let it be. We're not asking for anything. It's in the budget. It's right where we need it to be. The Hortonville Village Administrator says for years, lobbyists have influenced state lawmakers to move the money in the governor's budget away from the Highway 15 project and into other places. We're kind of drawing a uh, line in the sand now. We're hoping that it's our turn. And as the can has been kicked down the road for the past two decades, the project only gets more expensive by the millions. The price tag on it right now is $137.7 million. But most of all, it's a safety issue. The DOT estimates 20,000 people are driving up and down Highway 15 every day. It's a highway with only one lane going each way, making it dangerous for drivers to pass other cars or turn. The expansion would create two lanes in either direction, along with a bypass to ease congestion. Is it a DOT issue? Is it a legislature issue? Fingers seem to be pointing at each other. We just got to get those people on the same page. In Hortonville, Alexandra Burnley, Local 5 News. Now, if state lawmakers keep the Highway 15 project in the budget and it's then signed by Governor Evers, construction would get underway in 2021 and wrap up by 2024 or 2025.